Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. It's Pat again. I'd like to talk a little bit about um, let the revelations begin. People go to great lengths trying to wing knowledge of God. And when all they need to do is go to the Bible. God doesn't hold back from anyone. It's his will for everyone. God sends his word to reveal the truth. So we just need to open the book and read it. Not just what's written in red from Jesus, but all of it. When the devil came and attempted Jesus, he didn't fight with all, fight off all the special legions of the angels that were, were, were there to protect him off. He used the phrase, it is written. And God has equipped us all um, to do the same. He's given us his word. He's given us the Holy Spirit. He's given it to us to all understand it. He is more than ready to give it all. You the knowledge you read. We just need to open the book and let the revelations begin. Well, my friends and family, I opened up my Bible yesterday and it was a beautiful day. I made a video about confession, my story, my children. I won't post it until they have viewed it and we discussed it as a family. But I want to be consistent in doing my videos and sharing God's word. My video with God's word and on passive, they both guide me and bring me joy always. So our hearts ache, but we always have joy. We are poor, but we give spiritual riches to each other. We own nothing and yet have everything. That was in a verse that I read this morning. Um, you know, it's easy to confuse joy with happiness because both bring to mind positive feelings, maybe memories filled with laughter and smiles. But happiness is a, an emotion that comes and goes according to our situation and our circumstances just like the sunshine and the clouds each day. It can be here one day and gone the next. The fullness of joy, however, is, it, is experienced in our hearts, regardless of our surroundings and our experiences. The fullness of God's love pours forth a wellspring and unspeakable unspe joy. So I ask that we take the, that fullness of joy with you today in every situation, at work, at home, when we meet family, when we meet friends, or wherever it is. I know today I'm full of joy 
just to do this video. I'm grateful to wake up each day and see the sunrise just for all the little blessings I receive today as it is starts. My day will bring by going on, began, I should say, by going on a webinar right after I finish this video. And that's an experience. Praise to the Lord. I, I feel the joy, the happiness, the patience, the guidance, the love. Because our Zooms fill me with joy, peace, love, guidance, strength. Each day as a founder and what I hear. Because there's a lot of God's word in our our Zooms between the founders and our Mr. Ash Farah. What a true blessing that I was given and the joy it brings to my heart. The reason I believe I have the joy in my heart of Foran Passif and Mr. Ash Mafara is because I have whole joy the meaning from Jesus in my spirit and in my heart. And when we believe and trust, nothing is impossible. All is, impos is possible. Let me tell you today what Jesus and Mr. Ash Mafara each give to me and everyone else that believes, trusts, has patience, has guidance, and the strength. Whoa. It's amazing. It's powerful. So how else would I like to feel or want to feel in my life besides having all this? First, Jesus. Second, my children and family. Third, on passive. Because everything I do is with belief and trust. And when we believe, we have it all. You'll rise above and just be yourself and feel the joy in all you do and why you do it. I feel the joy and I am being myself today and pray to do it every day you know I really want to leave a legacy for my children to follow with God's word and with on passive I'll be able to leave them a legacy that way also I believe we are working hand in hand to change humanity all around the globe. And this is God's words, is to change one person's life, lead them to him. And I believe in on passive with the technology that we have We'll be able to change humanity all around the globe. We will be able to bless the way the Lord wants us to bless. It's a gift that keeps giving. You know, I use an app called the Bible app. That's technology. And I praise God every day for that technology because I don't read well. So if I'm able to listen to the app, to comprehend it the way I'm able to, to be myself, I love it. And I know with the on passive technology 
of AI and the products that they have coming. It's going to help many, many people like O Academy, our e-learning. You know what? I'll be able to go on O Academy and give a course, but I don't call it a course. I call it a blessing because I'll be able to pray with others around the globe. And it'll be through on passive O Academy. We'll have an um, O net, a social network where we'll be able to be secure. Our information won't be sold. Again, it's the trust, the belief, the patience, the guidance that he gives us through the Lord and through on passive. So what are you looking for in your life today to change? Is it just to find yourself, be yourself? Is it the knowledge of God's word? Is it time freedom? Is it residual income? Is it to leave a legacy for generations? That's what I want to do is to leave it for my children so that they don't have to go through what I went through with all the struggles. And it's all done for us. And I also want to be able to change humanity, whether it's one person, one family, one village, one city, one province, one country at a time. Because Mr. Ash says, we're not able to change the whole world, but if we can change one person's life, that's a reward. And I feel the same way when I teach what I know about the Bible, God's word. If I'm able to touch one heart and turn them to Jesus, that's my reward. And praise be to God. <clears throat> well, folks, I just wanted all those to know that I have an opportunity and so can you. I'm a very proud founder in On Passive, but I'm very honored to be God's child and to share his word. So everything equals value, value, value. That I'm able to do both. And working it together in my life. Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank you all for taking the time to listen. Please share and comment. Or get back to me if you need help in any way with God's word or in on passive because they work both hand in hand with trust, belief. So peace, joy, love, happiness, belief, trust, Receive and accept, but be yourself. That's the most important part. So stay safe and be blessed. Sending prayers and hugs and love to anyone around the globe that is in need, because I know there's so many. God bless and have a wonderful day. Stay positive. Let the negative go. Trust and believe. Thank you.